I'm Jerome Lamar. I am the owner of 9J, the concept store in the South Bronx, and I like to call myself a cultivator of culture. of a designer and art curator all in one. My world is a mix of fantasy and streetwear. I like the idea of mixing old and new. So we have antiques, new technology in the store, and we have new designers along with some vintage pieces as well. So I like to cultivate culture in the sense that I like to tie the old and the new to move things forward. Let me say this, I am the Bronx. I feel like I am, I was born to push things forward within the borough, I was born to uh, show that the Bronx is beautiful. I was born to show the world how much influence we have on culture. And so everything I do since the beginning of time has been to connect the Bronx to the world. Or should I say the world to the Bronx because we've been here. And whether I am super rich or poor, which I don't plan to be, it's always going to be something that I'm about. I was blessed to have a career that uh, blossomed early on in life. Starting at the age of 15, working for Baby Fat by Kimora Lee Simmons. At the time, it was the hottest brand in the world. You couldn't go down the street without seeing a girl wearing a Baby Fat Cat logo. Um, and I was part of that beginning, which was really beautiful. And so I saw myself as the person who was really to the ground, who could connect the dots, and I became the voice of reason for most people in the boardroom of Baby Fat, which is a huge corporate company at the time. And they would react a certain way to me. So that allowed me to kind of test the grounds and see what people really wanted on the streets, right? If I didn't feel like I was uncomfortable, then it wasn't doing anything. Those same people later on started dressing and coming to me for advice on like, where to go buy this, where to go buy that. And I kept saying, you know, go to the city to buy this and buy that. Um, which put an idea in my brain to say, one day maybe I should open up something in the Bronx, like a shop in the Bronx, that would be so cool. But I, did, I never thought it would happen. So long story short, working at Baby Fat, riding the bus, the real bus of like, people you know like Erica Mayne, which is so funny. Um, traveling the world, working you know for different brands like Nike, Adidas, L'Oreal, Procter & Gamble, to give them insight on trends and color and concept was something that is really, you know, part of my heritage. So, yeah, I bridged the Bronx to the world or vice versa.